You might have seen something similar to this code when working with documents, browsing websites, or using design apps. You also probably know it defines color somehow. But how exactly? What does this weird code with the hashtag actually mean? To fully understand what this code means, you first need to wrap your head around two concepts related to computer graphics, and that's RGB screens and the hexadecimal system. And both are really easy to understand. RGB screens are displays and monitors you encounter in your daily life. And this is what they look like under a microscope. You can see three distinct colors, red, green and blue. Hence the name, RGB screens. By lighting up each of these to a certain level and arranging millions of those units into a grid, you can show basically any color a person can see. Next, the hexadecimal system. It works similar to the number system you're familiar with, which is the decimal system, with one key difference. The value doesn't just go from 0 to 9, it goes from 0 to F, like this. What this means is that while using the classic decimal system, one digit provides you with 10 different values. With the hexadecimal one, however, you have the possibility of showing any number from 0 to 15 while using a single digit. With two digits, that's 16 times 16 which is 256. Now, remember when I showed you the screen under a microscope and said that you can light up each of these colors to a certain extent? Well, the extent is usually 255 for completely lit up and zero for completely dark. That's 256 options in total. Do you also remember what I said about two hexadecimal digits being able to display 256 different numbers? Yes, that's it. This code and all codes in this specific format are nothing more than a representation of how illuminated each of the RGB colors in a display is. I hope you learned something new in this video. If you did, please leave a like and subscribe to learn more about design.